first time viewer, ASMRs where I'll be whispering and stuff. I'll be showing y'all my collections and stuff. I'll be making noise and the mic and stuff. And doing all this and stuff. So anyways, today, I know y'all see by the title. I got the manga collection. Now, if you didn't know, there's a lot of anime conventions going on. Where people dress up as different characters. They dress up as, you know, Samurai John Blue characters, Mugen, Cowboy Bebop, Dragon Ball Z, Naruto, Sword Online, you might dress up Darling, maybe anything you know, they dress up as. So I thought since this anime convention season is summertime, I'll show y'all my collection. I know y'all always be looking in the background. Some of y'all be commenting. Y'all be peeping and creeping. I see you in the comments. What's that in the background? What's that on the wall? Mind your business, okay? You're going to see it soon enough. Now, today, I brought that here for you. So, I'm not going to go particularly in order. But I'm going to show you, uh, you know, what I got. And what I'm going to get, probably. So, let's just start off with the first one I've ever bought. Before I decided to start a collection. Devil Man. Now, I watched Devil Man the... Um, not the day it came out, but like the month it came out. Probably like a week after it came out. I remember it was like January 2019 or 2020. One of those years. And I watched Devil Man on Netflix and it was amazing. Then I decided to go on YouTube and watch the OG Devil Man. Because they have it on YouTube if you didn't know. In the dub version. Funny as shit, boy. But uh, anyways. I got this right here. This is the Devil Man. Manga is very thick. Uh, I went and got all of my stuff I get from Barnes and Nobles because you know I don't know where you or half of y'all be finding y'all manga stores but I be seeing people on TikTok they be uh, they be they stores be deep and I, I gotta go to a basically a library for these and that's tough so uh yeah Barnes and Nobles I gotta go there sometimes I gotta order it in because they don't have it in stock but uh yeah devil man I know y'all like the page sounds too so I, I guess y'all do, but we about to just, you know, look, do speed run. Speed run, speed run. I like hardcover books personally, because I can't do none of that soft cover stuff. Because, um, I don't know, stuff just be bending, but some of this is soft cover because they ain't got it in hardcover. But hardcover is also more uh, expensive. But yeah, Devil Man Cry Baby, or Devil Man. As it is originally. And, uh, yeah. So that's that. That's Devil Man. Um, I don't really have much space on my desk, so I don't really got much place to put them. If y'all can see what's on it, it's literally piles, piles of my, you know, I'm just showing you a little peep. Little pop peep. Okay, okay, y'all can't see no much. Y'all can't see no much. Um, I know y'all see a little bit of monster back there. Alright, so next up, um, Death Note. Uh, my I gotta sneeze real quick, hold on. Bless me, thank you, you're welcome. Thank you for all the ones who said bless you. Now, uh, Death Note, as y'all know, my favorite series ever. I'm gonna show y'all some, some, uh, figures I got later too, but Death Note. I might as well just show y'all the full Death Note collection I got. But yeah. Uh, I got the black addiction. I'm addiction. I yeah, I'm addicted to that. But I got the black edition, and yeah, I didn't get the regular one. Although I might go and buy the regular one and the, and you know keep with this. So uh, yeah, some of these, as you can see, are open. Well, like one of them is open, and the others are still in their respective things. So. Ah, uh, that is that. Uh, here's the other ones. You know, got that Death Note. Bow. I love me some Death Note, man. I know y'all know that. I got, you know, la, 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 la. I know y'all know that. So, uh, let's get straight into the next one. So, there's not much to say about that. The series is very short, so there's not many books. Uh, let me turn the mic a little. So, you can hear me on both sides. You know what I'm Alright, so next up in the Death Note collection, I haven't read this one yet, but this is 
basically the same book, but it's the all-in-one edition. So it's all of those books in this. And it's much smaller. It also has like a little, um, I don't know what you call it. Not an excerpt, but it's like a little section in a, a prequel sequel. No, no, no. What's, what's the word where it's just like an extra something at the end of a series or movie, movies or whatever. It has that with Nier or Nate River. And, uh... Nice sound. But yeah, this is a Death Note all-in-one edition. And uh, yeah, it's pretty sturdy. I haven't read it yet. I will read it soon. I have a lot of Death Notes to get through. Um, even though I, I watched this, this series like six times, I watched... Uh, like almost all the movies I have one more movie to go which is called L change the world and I'm going to buy that no fact I already bought it but I haven't watched it yet it just came in the mail like a week ago but uh, next in the death note collection <clears throat> don't want to spoil none so I gotta hide these is wow my DVDs and such hold on This is difficult. <clears throat> Cause I don't wanna accidentally stop the recording or nothing. But uh my okay, I'm gonna actually get through the books first. I have L Change the World book. I have to read it before I watch the movie probably, but it doesn't really matter to me. But uh as you can see it's unpacked no it is unpackaged, but uh Death Note Change the World. Uh I love the cover art on this. It's really, really fire. I sort of sad. Uh, I read this. This is Death Note, the BB murder cases. Uh, I'm all over the place. This is Death Note, the BB murder cases with BB or, you know, Beyond Birthday. He looks like Lolly, but he's like an evil version or, you know, he has makeup to make himself look like it's crazy. Y'all go read it. But yeah. This. some noises so this is like a book book there's not you know there's nothing like manga a manga art or nothing in that <clears throat> so like I said I just bought this L change the world I'm gonna have to watch that um, I, I got Death Note Light Up the New World and this movie was ass. I'm sorry, look, just cause I love Death Note don't mean I like everything I gotta do with it. This movie was terrible. Terrible. And I will never watch it again. Yeah, I don't think I will, honestly. Uh, this is the series, y'all know the series, the regular anime. This is what this is. I still have the cover. So yeah, it's just that. So if I'm ever traveling, I could just take it with me if there's no internet or something like that. Because I do got crunchy roll, you know what I'm talking about. Now next up, <clears throat> Death Note 2, the last name. This is the second to this, which is, this is literally just like the animated series. But this is actually done really well. I'm not going to lie. I like this. I like these two. These are actually fire way better than that. these are bro if if you want to go see a live action death note stay away from the netflix no i do not have that in physical copy that is bro, that don't exist it don't exist but uh yeah i would uh i'll say just you know not just, just stick with those stick with those bro you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying uh <clears throat> move those to the side so it's not in your face for the place okay uh, i think that's it um yeah that's it for death note uh so next up <clears throat> we're 
we're just gonna get into this since it's very short this is my newest edition aside from the one i'm about to show you after this rent a girlfriend check that out yeah Uh, Rent a Girlfriend is actually a really, really good anime, in my opinion. It's it's really good. It's like if you just want to watch something to pass the time or something like that. It's actually real. It's, it's good. Like, it's just a decent anime. So I was like, you know, let me just get a couple of these. I don't think I'm going to get the full series, but let me get a couple of these so I could just, you know, rewatch, reread, whatever uh, stuff. And, uh, yeah, it's. Oh, they got some color up in there. Hold on. That's not, oh, my bad. Uh, but yeah, rent a girlfriend. Pretty simple. Nah, don't worry. It's not no girly, girly anime. So yeah, don't get on me for that. And there ain't nothing wrong with the girly anime. I like, between you and me, I like Tony Kawa over the moon. And Vampire Night. That's between me and Bunny Girl Senpai. That's between me and you, though. Don't go running off and telling people. Don't, don't kiss and tell. Don't pillow talk. All right, keep that between me and you. All right, all right. Then. So, uh, yeah, rent a girlfriend and that's that. So, in fact, yeah, I'm gonna just get through this now because this is a, a chunk of a series, and this is the one I just told y'all about that I just finished watching. Uh, what's in y'all face? Oh, that's Death Note. <clears throat> Let me just put that over here. So, uh, let me rise up a little bit. So, anyways, like I was saying, this chunk of a series is called Monster. And it is one of the best anime I've ever seen in my entire life. Aside from Death Note. Because it's literally like a drama series it is not like an anime like you watch to make powers and no it's literally like mystery cops killings drama family stories love stories it's 2 a.m who's racing my motorcycle down the street this like it's 2 a go home it's it's about to be saturday bro relax anyway monster it's like a drama like i said it has it, it literally is paced like a your netflix series like and what i mean by that is it shows the main character and his little story then it shows this character then this character has their own section of the show then it doesn't stay on the main character like most anime so it's literally like he it's like well i don't know 10 different characters with their own parts in the stories and own backgrounds and it is fire bruh it's fire so let's just get into it <clears throat> it has nine but these are very bulky and very heavy it's uh you know some very good stuff i'm definitely gonna read this uh i just love i just love monster bruh so uh yeah if y'all want some, if y'all want a recommendation, watch this. It's like 70 some episodes, but the pacing makes it feel like it's a, it's, it's a thousand. Okay. I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. The pacing of the show makes it feel like you watching a thousand episodes and it's only like 74, 75, but yeah, read the manga, bro. Look, look at that. Read them. Don't, I'm not spoiling y'all. Read the manga. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah, comes with more. Wow. Bob comes with more. So you know what I'm saying? This might be the thumbnail. <laughs> Watch me make a thumbnail real quick. Alright. But uh yeah. This is one chunk of a series. Um, I know there's longer stuff like One Piece and all that. Well, no, I'm not talking about like, what, 50 years worth of an ad. No, I'm just talking about in general. The pacing 
It's not like power scaling. It's literally like regular human beings in a show. So yeah, there's there's that. <clears throat> now next we got Tokyo Ghoul. Not this is Rick. Not Ray. This is Tokyo Ghoul. Only got three of these. These are very expensive, so they don't have to wait. But fresh new book smell. You know you gotta keep your books intact. You know. I know y'all like that. Give y'all some noises. Um, but yeah, Tokyo Ghoul. Uh, I just got one, two, and three. Every time I get a new series, I always gotta get at least three of them, which is why y'all see Rent a Girlfriend with three. And I'm about to show y'all the next one with three after this. But, uh,. Every time I get a new manga series, I, I it has to be three. It has to be three. I can't get two, just one. No, I got to get at least three of them. But usually it's, it's of an anime that I've already seen before. So, yeah. The only thing I've read here before watching the anime was Death Note. So, yeah. Uh, next up, like I said, the next three in the batch, the next trio, is one of my other favorite shows. Parasite. Now I love Parasite so much. It, I put it off so much because my immature thinking was that it was like a ripoff of Tokyo Ghoul with the fact that the ghouls and the parasites and the steal the bodies. No, it's a lot different and it is very good. Like, wow, it's very good. And it has to do with the type of stuff I like anyway. So, Parasite, one, two, three. You know, it's a. Uh, some really nice stuff pretty much really nice stuff if y'all haven't seen parasite go watch it i think it's 24 episodes parasite the max i'm not sure but uh yeah now i'm not done yet i got uh, i got one more series to show y'all after this one but this is some art okay can y'all get guess right now what it is Guess what this series is going to be. But you put your guess in the comments. I. Joe. Joe's Bizarre Adventure. So. Wow. Look at this. Bro. Jojo has so many books. And it is. Hard cover, just how I like it, and I need to get Finland Saga because it is also hard cover, and I love Finland Saga. So yeah, this is one, two, three, and four, and this I think is Stardust Crusaders. Yeah, Stardust Crusaders is with Joe Taro, so you know the nigga that everyone pretty much knows. The Oro Oro Oro, that's him. So uh, yeah, look how beautiful and bright and blue it is that's what i love about the jojo mangas they're so they're so artful and colorful atmospheric full uh i also need the illustration book if anybody knows where to get that let me know because i haven't seen it in any bookstore so if i gotta go online to get the illustration i did so uh, yeah jojo's bizarre adventure man check that out It's just some of the best stuff to look at, honestly. Honestly. And you know, you just got the... It looks like you're watching the show when they have that stuff in the intro. The little black screen with the little... To be continued or whatever. But uh, yeah. That outro, whatever. Uh, so next, the last thing I'm going to show y'all before I show you the figurines. Is... The... Is the Junji collection. I know y'all probably didn't expect no Junji to be in here. But yes, this is the latest of the series I got from Junji. It is called No Longer Human. Yeah, No Longer Human by Junji. And if y'all don't know who Junji is, Uzumaki, Gyo, uh, what's the other one? 
uh, Tomi, all that stuff. Shiver. Now, uh, yeah, Junji also has an anime, if you didn't know. You can get it on uh, Crunchyroll. So, uh, yeah. human i gotta read this i read like four pages of it and i just went to sleep but yeah next up i know y'all know the uzumaki it's one of the most popular ones look at this look at this beauty look at that look at that ah uh, look at that it's just it's just nice it's just so Uzumaki, Uzumaki, not Naruto Uzumaki, just Uzumaki Junjito. Next up, we got Shiver. Uh, I also got Gyo. No, I have Tomi. I don't think I have Gyo. I have Tomi, but uh, we got Shiver, also by Junji. You know, check that out. This is pretty good. I didn't read this one yet, but uh, I will. You know, got got that horror stuff going on up in there and uh yeah shiver so next up wow i didn't read this either but this one is what is it called love sickness yeah um i think i actually watched this one on the anime i'm pretty sure i saw this story on the anime but uh yeah love sickness this is pretty yeah yeah, yeah, I think this is the one. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I saw this one on the anime. They didn't cover the full story, but this is the one. So yeah, Junji right there. And last but not least, Tomi by Junji. This is also the other one. Uh, I can't show y'all that because I might get uh, demonetized. But, uh, yeah. I can't show y'all that one. Okay. Okay, I don't think I can show y'all any of this, if I'm being honest. There's a lot of no clothes. Action going on for some of the art pieces but uh yeah told me ah look at this uh, but uh anyways i'm about to show y'all the collection the the, um, the figurines uh there's one missing but it's just seen on from Sora online in the blue outfit the blue and white outfit but the other ones are right here so uh yeah i'm about to show y'all that real quick so my first ever figurine i think he was my first i'm not sure it's either him or sasuke no i think it was sasuke no it was i think it was him but uh, Goku Black, this is my guy, bro. I love Goku Black. I stopped watching Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball Super once they went to the Gyu Force with Gohan and all that weird film shit. But that fell off of me. But uh, yeah, Goku Black, this nigga do not stand up, by the way. He just leans, so I had to super glue his feet. But uh, yeah, Goku Black right here, that's my guy. That's just my guy, bro. He's a, he's a menace, man. And then the next up, I also got my boy Sasuke Uchiha. Sasuke. Yeah. Not much to say, but he got the Chidori. And uh, he got the Kusanagi blade. Not much to say, but it's my boy Sasuke. Now for Death Note. 
Uh, Cause that's all there is left. I have my boy, Lolly. It, it took forever to find this nigga, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I actually wanted a different figure, and I'm still gonna try to find it. But you know, I got what I got, and I like it. So, Lolly, it, it's just that's my guy, bro. I love this figurine so much. So yeah, not much to say with that. Give y'all some taps with it. <clears throat> you got my boy Light Yagami. Say La Yagami, Light Yagami backwards. Yagami, spell that backwards. Okay, now uh, he's holding the world and he has another hand where he's holding an apple, I think. Or it's just a fist, but his hand is back on my stuff. But yeah, you got the um, Death Note. My boy looking to the stars. And then, uh, yeah. It's not much else. Man's fitted up. That's it. And then last but not least, I got Ryuk. Oh, no. Actually, I have one more after Ryuk. But, uh, yeah. It's my boy. He looking tough. Look, look how good he look. His fit is so fire, bro. Golf King. My apologies. I hit the mic. But uh, yeah. This about to be a bit to put up. But actually what I'm about to do. I'm about to put these back on my shelf. And I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to take y'all with me. And I'm going to do a collection. Um, putting collection back. So stay tuned. <sighs> Rem. Last but not least, I got Rem right here. So yeah, this nigga ugly. But uh, Rem is also a female. But um, in my mind, Rem is still a boy. I don't care. But yeah, boy G's. Okay. <clears throat> So, now that that is finished, I'm going to take y'all with me over to the shelf, and we're going to put these back, and I'm going to end the video off. So, um, this is the last you'll see of my face, and I hope you enjoy your night.